The Olu Political Consultative Assembly says it's exploring all legal means to ensure the arrest of former Governor Imukai Hedio for allegedly sponsoring insecurity in the state. Rising from a crucial meeting in Oweri, the group alleged that a leaked audio in circulation alleged to be the voice of Mr. Hedio justifies their position that the former governor is responsible for the security challenges bedeviling the state. In a swift reaction, the leadership of Olu Oweri dismissed the allegation against the former governor. It also described members of the Olu Political Consultative Assembly as political jabbers seeking attention. Opoka, after 48 hours, after presentation, call for citizen arrest of a making head on. Yes. Wherever he is found in the threshold and territory of Imo State. Yeah, that's right. And there will be a bounty if after 48 hours the security agencies, after all the killings, all the lives lost, all the insecurity, all the opening of over a prison services, over 1,000 inmates released to torment Imo State and he's continuing after 48 hours. Enough is enough. There will be declared citizen arrest and there will be a bounty, how he said. The voice the Facebook organization was making reference to is distorted, fake, and should be disregarded by every way of being in Nigeria. Yeah, at several times, the government have come up to say Rucha Sokorocha is the one sponsoring insecurity in the most states. They have also said Rucha Wosi is the one sponsoring. They have also accused several other people. And today, because the rising popularity of Ihedon has become a threat to the government of the day, they resorted to using the same uh, 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 hacker jobbers. 